mambo vipi mtazamaji wangu wa Davida TV Geoffrey Mwachala hapa your presenter e bana leo tuko na swala lingine moto la kuongelea leo bana tunaongelea swala la ushoga na usagaji hivi majuzi tuna tuna vile tunapata kuelewa kwamba ushoga na usagaji umekubaliwa katika nchi ya Kenya hiyo ni bayana na si ati mimi namlaumu rais wetu mheshimiwa wetu Samuel Ruto si ati namlaumu no ila nalaumu wazungu wazungu ndio wa usika wakuu katika kuleta ushoga na usagaji kivipi wazungu wana 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 pressurize wanatumia advantages zenye unazo wana wana ili kupata msaada sisi wa Afrika sisi wa Kenya kupewa msaada na pesa imekuwa ni kwamba lazima tupitishe tupitishe ili swala la ushoga na usagaji ili ndo pesa endelee kuingia na vyakula pia vyendele kuingia sasa mimi nakashifu ili swala naona kwamba si si sawa kabisa na Yaani nalikashifu kwa roho yangu yote. Ushoga ni hata ukiangalia katika vitabu vya dini, Quran na Biblia vyote vimekashifu ushoga. Hasa iweje leo Afrika tunaruhusu janga hili kwa sababu mimi naliita janga kwa sababu nitasababisha majanga. Ushoga si uongo. Hata ukiangalia Sodoma na Gomora ilishushua mvua ya moto kwa ajili ya swala kama hili hili ushoga na usagaji sasa leo hii Afrika Kenya imefika mahali kwamba imebidi tukubali kwa sababu ya kuwategemea nani kuwategemea wazungu mimi sioni kwamba ni sawa kabisa na hili swala na likashifu sasa mtazamaji wangu wa Davida TV naomba utazame hii video ambayo ni ya bunge bunge la Kenya ambalo wako na jadili swala la ushoga vile ambalo limekubaliwa na kama tunaweza badilisha ama tunaweza kutokea kama tukapindua kwa sababu court ndio imeamua kwamba hao watu wako free na wako huru wanaweza ndio tukatai hao watu wako huru kila mtu na uhuru wake kila mtu anaweza kubali yani kila mtu ana uhuru wake hata mashoga na uhuru wao hata hao ma, masagaji lakini haimaanishi kwamba tu wakubali so hebu tazama hii video then tutatueleza Yes. If there is anything I support President Yoweri Kaguta Museveni on is on the issue of LGBT. Honorable Speaker, I will not be go to the extreme in how you deal with them, but we must be forthright as a nation to protect our own cultures, our religion, and our beliefs, and we must not allow those countries from the West who believe in those things, let them believe in whatever they want to believe in, but they must not force us to believe in the things they believe in. Sorry, I withdraw that bit. I withdraw that bit in the interest and the respect for the animal kingdom. The animal kingdom never engages in that. But the next thing they're going to tell us is that somebody, somebody has a right, a man has a right to marry a woman. They want to tell us that a woman has a right, sorry, to marry another man, or a woman has a right to marry a, a woman. What do we to my women who are married do to do? What is there? God has created a man and a woman. It's there in all the Abrahamic scriptures. It's in Islam. It's in Christianity. It's in Judaism.